Howdy y'all, my name is Press, I'm coming at you once again with another episode of Press's Rogues Gallery, and today we are playing the wonderful Super House of Dead Ninjas! Alright, so this is a game that I have had for a little while, I got it right when it came out, which was a couple years ago? I don't know, I don't even remember, but I remember when it first came out, and I remember Ash sending me a Steam message essentially saying like, what the hell game are you playing? Because the title Super House of Dead Ninjas is like the most bonkers name ever, but it totally fits what this game is. Now, Super House of Dead Ninjas, I guess the closest thing that I can um, equate this to is it's like a roguelike uh, Ninja Gaiden from the original NES, which Ninja Gaiden, amazing game. I remember playing that when I was a kid. That was like one of like the four or five um, NES games that we had when I was a kid. It was like uh, Legend of Zelda, Mario, you know, all the, all all the classics and then like Ninja Gaiden and I remember loving Ninja Gaiden just I had so much fun even though I could barely get past like the first boss like whenever I beat the first boss I considered that beating the game because of how hard as nails that game was so this is like a procedural version of that game where the um, whole point of this is like you're kind of starting at the top of the tower and you want to make your way all the way down to the bottom and so the um, dungeon layouts are completely random and like you keep getting these um, different layouts and the whole thing is to try and keep your speed up and get through it um, because uh, you, there's a timer and if you run out of time you'll die. You regain that time by uh, getting certain distances, getting pickups, all that kind of stuff. Anyways, let's move a little bit forward so you can see some stuff. So, normally this game starts out and you have no choices of things from the beginning. Weapons, upgrades, and other. Obviously I've played quite a bit of this game so I have a lot of stuff that I can show off, which is great. Um, I don't have everything on Locked, but I do have some, which is wonderful. So, uh, we're gonna start out with the katana of miffed barbarians. So this one always beheads enemies. And for our distance weapon, let's go with um, what's this one? The ricochet of litigious possibilities bounces off the floor, ceilings, and walls until it hits an enemy or expires. That sounds kind of cool. We also have throwing axes, which are nice because it'll like fall down, like in uh, Rogue Legacy. Um, longer range than standard boomerang, boomerang. Reused over and over and over again, but has a short range. Let's do that. Let's use the battle bash boomerang. And then we can have bombs or grenades. We'll stick with bombs for now. And then as far as our magic, let's go with the wind magic from the bowels. Finally, let's look at our upgrades, which I think these, yeah, these are all just automatically applied. So our life is going to be a little bit longer than default, all these other things. So we're actually probably in a good state to be able to make it quite a bit farther than than, um, usual. Let's see, we've also got a parachute, which activates automatically to slow a fall if it is more than one floor, so you can kind of make your way down, although I kind of speed through sometimes. Um, so we have all these bonuses that you get as you play through it. So the game sort of, as you play it more and more, it kind of gives you things to help you get further in, which I love. I think that's a great way of doing progression. It's kind of like Isaac. Like the more you play Isaac, you know, the game, it kind of ends, you know, first it ends at just fighting the mom's foot. And then you slowly get to fighting mom's heart and fighting mom's heart enough times. And then you get to go and fight, you know, Isaac and, you know, and so on and so forth. So, uh, so yeah, anyway, we've got all these different suits. You can see that as you move forward, you get different colored suits. I'm excited to get the uh, frog princess suit slowly get towards that uh, uh, green color but uh, we'll stick with the ziggurat dungeon suit this is nice kind of like you know lightish blue very cool uh, hey, you know what no you know what it's Valentine's Day when this goes up huh we're going pink let's go which one's the pinkest I think we'll go with this one the fatal fuchsia that's a good that's a good Valentine's lovely color to go with let's just jump into this game we're gonna start at the top and uh, let's see how it goes. All right, it has been a while since I've played this, so uh, uh, it'll take me a little bit to get there. So, got a melee attack, huzzah. Uh, hey, yeah, yeah. Okay. And uh, let's see, it wants us to bomb, so I'll do that. Gotcha, sucker. Crouch. Ha! And I threw my thing. All right, and so now, as you can see, uh, as I kill guys, I get these little like bonuses. Oh, I missed a timer there. Uh, and if you look in the upper right, I've now got rage. My rage meter filled, which means that I'm like basically invincible and I can just go annihilate guys uh, like crazy. And that's what it's all about. It's all about building up these like just crazy, crazy runs where you just keep on going through. All right, I need timer. All right, let's kill all these suckers. Oh man, this is so much fun, I love this. All right, so just for those of you who maybe plan on picking this game up, just know you will not be like this uh, when you first start playing. You will die a lot, <clears throat> and that's because uh, it's very difficult. That guy was named NB Panda. That's a friend of mine. Holy crap, I didn't know that this game did that. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, that, that's an IRL friend of mine. That's amazing. All right, let's keep going. Oh, I could have knocked those down, but I'm just gonna keep moving. All right, we'll keep moving. Get out of here. All right, now our rage is gonna run out, but that's fine. We made it far on that one. Oh, and I ran right into that guy. Hey, get out of here. Think you can mess with me. Grab that money. All right. 
So yeah, as you can see, it's just all about just like keep moving, keep moving. Oh, whoops, didn't mean to get that close to him. Hoo -ah, hoo -ah. Let's just go straight down. Okay, grab that timer. Oh, that guy hit me. Back off, jerk. All right. And so yeah, you just want to. Okay, good, careful. Careful. Oh, missed my double jump. Ha! I wanted that. Okay. Eh. Boom! Boom! Ha ha! Hua! And so, yeah, as you can see, it's a pretty crazy game. I love the pacing of it. And really, once you uh, really get into it, you start really enjoying what you're doing. It's, oh, you jerk. Uh, it can it can get pretty wild. And we should be, oh, that was close. Uh, we should be, oh, what a doofus. Eh, okay. Move through. Oh, yeah. See, I don't even have much I can say during this because it's so fast-paced. But um, hopefully you guys can see what I mean by the Ninja Gaiden style. Like, I mean, it really is pretty obvious uh, how Ninja Gaiden-y this is. Those guys I probably should have rushed through and killed because I would have been able to build up my rage meter. And now we're at a boss, which means I'll probably die because it's been so long since I've played this game that I don't really know how to do this boss stuff. Okay. Oh, no. Can I hit him with this? Uh, I want to try and hit him with the boomerang because, yeah, because that'll help a little bit. He's very difficult to hit. All right. Okay. Yeah. That's right, sucker. Oh, no, he dropped bombs. Oh, darn. I was wondering why the bombs were dropping. I thought those were mine for a second. It's too bad. If you can kill the boss, I think, with just the katana, and, like, don't use any of your other items, just use the katana, you get some kind of bonus. All right. We're almost there. We're almost there. Eh. Come on. Eh. Hey, I'm, I'm going to scum him. That's fine. Close, close. Eh. Nope. Eh. One more. No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. One more. Happy Valentine's Day, Mother Trucker. We've got a little bit more life. Got a whole bunch of stuff. And now we're moving on to the next stage. And that's how this game works. All right. Uh, what? I pressed the button. How dare you. So now you can see that the... Oh, I love that. Rage. You guys have heard me before. That's how I rage. You know it. Got to kill them all. Um... I love how, like, just, like, yeah, the graphics kind of change as you make it to the new zones and how just the game progresses in this fashion. It's wonderful. Oh, we're out of rage. Out of rage. Welcome to the rage cage. Oh, I didn't realize those bad guys. And come on. All right. Now let's just roll on through here. All right. Oh, we died. But that's not the end because you do get two continues. So we can keep on going with this, and we're just going to keep on rolling through. We'll see how far we can get. Get out of here. The game does get progressively more difficult. As you can see, the uh, levels get a little more complex. The bad guys... Oh, shoot. The bad guys get a little bit tougher. So, uh, you have to be... Oh, what? I thought I had the thing that breaks those. Shoot. You can get, like, some perks and things or certain kinds of items that allow you to break traps as you go through them. Can I get you to drop? Thank you. Ah, uh, yep, yep. I, don't, I guess I don't have it. Ah. Uh, screw it. We're just rushing. Get out of here, monkey. I think you're all cool. You fire breath and things. Boom, take that, froggy. All right. Yeah, and I love the graphical stylings. I love all the stuff that's going on. Oh, shoot. Ed Briggs, that's so funny. It's like, these are people I know. I didn't realize that they did that. They named the champions after uh, people, that must be people like in your Steam friends list or uh, maybe in like a, your email list or something. I don't know. That's great. Oh, man. Oh, what? Oh, that's tricky. It has been a very long time since I played this game. So uh, I don't remember all of these things, but I also think that they've updated it since when I played it, because I, like I said, I got it when it launched. Uh, get out of here, jerks. Oh, oh. Let's go. Hoo-ha, hoo-ha. Get out of here. Uh, oh, that was close. Popped you like a little balloon. Hoo-ha. Hoo-ha. Okay. Oh, oh. Jerk. Oh, man, I love the, uh, the boomerang. It's a good weapon. The gun is also pretty good, too, I will say. Oh, are we in another boss? Oh, we're in trouble, y'all. We're in trouble. I don't know this guy. Unstoppable Torment. I'll take you out. Another boomerang shot. Yeah, this guy's a boomerang boss, if I ever saw one. Because it comes back through the back, because that's what it's all about. All right, as you can see, get the boomerang. Shit, this is wonderful. What? Okay, okay. What? Oh. Uh, and we're done. Dude, did you see that? That was like, we killed him. We didn't even get hit by him, did we? That was amazing. This might be the best I've ever done in this game. It's all pure luck, I promise. All right. How much time do we have? 40 seconds? Yeah, I think that like our time things are worth, whoa, more than they were uh, the first time I played this game as well because of upgrades and things that I've gotten. So it's pretty nice. Oh, what did I just... 
Oh, that just do. Oh, and I did. I killed myself. And I think we got one more. Yeah, we got one more. Continue. Nice. I love this map that we're in now. This like sparkly wonderland. It's great. Oh, so another thing that this game has. Maybe we'll uh, we'll go check this out once we uh, once we inevitably pass away here. Um, is oh, careful. Oh, come on. I should have dropped the bomb. That's what I should have done. Okay. Oh, what the? Come on. All right, now we gotta pick one. Let's go middle. No, I said middle. It's fine. Whoa, whoa. Oh, it was a spiky guy. Stay away from the spiky guy. Back off. All right, you can see as we descend, we can do like that spinny move, which is nice. Oh, back off. Rage. Go to the rage cage. I haven't used very much magic. Let's uh. I forget what button that is, actually. Is it this one? Yeah, there we go. How do you like that, jerks? Okay, let's, uh, come on. No, I was trying to jump right over it. That sucks. Get out of here, get out of here. Get out of here, all of you. Yeah, use my invincibility to my advantage. Timer. Okay. Ditch digger, I don't know that guy. Okay, okay. Yeah, you can back off, little skelly bones. I mean, I can't even tell what floor we're on because I can't even look away for like two seconds. Oh god, oh god. You monkey! Why you gotta do that? Oh, that's bad. That's bad. That's bad. We're gonna die, y'all. We're gonna die, y'all. Give me health. Damn it. Wanted health. Rage. Rage is good. That'll help us out a little bit. Okay. This is a good time to get rage to be invincible. Okay, 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 okay. I'm getting out of here. Leave me alone, monkey. I mean, I mean, froggy. Okay. All right, this is a good time as any to use this. Get out of here, all y'all. What? Dang, son. All right, that looks like this is going to be our end. Oh, I should have showed you that little thing. Anyway, he gets he gets killed. Let's watch. Let's see how far down. I think this is, yeah, that's the best I've ever done, actually. Oh, but not my best score. I've had a, a higher score. But how far down did I make it? Son of a bitch, I was almost there. Oh, you guys, I'm so mad. I'm so mad. That sucks. Because I've never actually beaten the whole tower before. I've never beaten the whole boss. Anyway, doesn't matter. Let's go back to the lodge. Uh, let us go to the main menu. And let's see if we can't see some of the... Is it the map editor that we go to? Uh, exit. Oh, nope. Da, da, da. Continue. I want to go to the Steam Workshop. Oh, I'd have to go to the workshop to do it. Darn it. Well, give me two seconds. I'm going to go find some of the most highly uh, loved maps, and I will be right back to show you guys some of the coolness. All right. See you in a bit. All right, y'all. So I tried getting some of the custom maps to work, and they don't seem to be working very well, which is too bad. So someone created a World 1-1 from Super Mario Bros., which is obviously that's what happens in every game that has a character or a map creator. And then someone also recreated a map from Castlevania. So that's really cool. And then there was another map I wanted to try out that was another highly rated one. But again, not working. So let's just go ahead and we'll play through again and because uh, we'll probably die quickly. Anyways, I'll show you some different weapons. Let's use the Mega Kurasa, Kusa, Kusarigama. The me Ultra Super Mega Kusarigama. This upgrade also destroys spike traps. That's a great one. And uh, instead of the boomerang, which was... I'm thinking boomerang with its endless uses is probably the best one for killing bosses. But let's grab a gun. We're bringing a gun. All right. Uh, and we'll take grenades. And instead of that magic, let's use flame magic from the pits. Okay. Uh, we're staying as pink because it's flipping uh, Valentine's. Okay. And... Let's, let's start at the top again. Who knows? Maybe we'll make it all the way down. All right. Run, sucker. All right. All right. So now you can see the Kusarigama. Very cool. Got that nice distance to it. hoo -ah. Let's use our grenade there. Get that monies. Okay. Uh, magic. hoo -ah. Nice, huh? Very cool. So as you can see, the, the tutorial part always starts the same. But, uh, oh, hello. Thank you for the bomb. Bam. Bam. Kusarigama's got a little bit of a wind-up to it, but uh, it can destroy traps, which is awesome. Die, sucker. Rage. Open with the rage cage. I know I've been saying that a lot. If y'all don't know what that is from, don't worry about it, but it's uh, from a really funny show. Uh, okay. Whoa, what was that? I don't think I've seen that before. Shoot. Yeah, die, suckers. Die, suckers. How do you like this? Huh? Oh, I didn't kill my friend. I didn't kill my friend. Oh, no. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay, yeah! Oh man, I'm loving this. Loving this. Alright, alright. Okay, okay, come on. Get out of here, sucker. 
All right. This Kusurigama might also be very good against the um, bosses because it does seem like it can go through enemies, you know? And I will show you the gun in a second, yeah, when it becomes useful. But since we've only got a limited number, break up. see, isn't that great? Since we only have a limited number of shots now, you know, I want to save it for the useful spots. Oh, it doesn't do it when you go downward, though. Good to know. Oh, what? Shh. Come on, dog. Get out of her. Get out of her. All right. Take you down. So, yeah, as you guys can see, this is, like, the perfect kind of game for me because I love having nice, like, you know, I don't want to call it mindless. I don't want to, you know, disrespect the makers of the game um, if they find that disrespectful. I wouldn't because what it is is it's, like, it's just it's all about pure you know, motion and skill. It's all about learning the maneuvers and everything. And uh, it's, it's wonderful. I love it. This is the perfect kind of game for me. All right, we got a boss here. We're going to be using some uh, guns on this guy. Is it the Cricket guy again? It's the Cricket guy again. Or the Agile Mantis, excuse me. Okay. Shot ya. Oh, didn't get, didn't get you there. Okay. Hitting him with the Kusurigama is going to be tough, I think. Nope. Nope. Okay. I'll just keep shooting. <laughs> All right, come on. Nope, too close. Man, I'm out of ammo. Dang! Oh, you can also bounce his bombs back up. I don't think that's the other way you're supposed to do it. Okay, come on. Come on, sucker. Oh, that was close. Eh. Eh. Okay. Eh. Yep, one more. Not oh, close. Oh, what? They called me an idiot. Screw you, buddy. How dare you? Life gets. Crap stuff. Let's move. All right, we got 10 more bullets. That's good. It's not going to be very good on that second boss. All right. Yeah, I don't expect to get as far as last time because that boomerang, I think that's like the game-winning item. All right, y'all. Rage cage. Oh, I love it. Oh, can't kill those. Just run past them because we got rage. It's nice. That's part of the benefit of rage is just being able to like run past crap. Get out of here. All right. Bad boar. Bad piggy. Oh, I didn't kill him. Usually I love piggies, but you know. Can't always be winners. I'll see you later. I'll see you later. All right, get away from me. Yeah, how you like that? Back off, monkey. I told you to leave me alone. I told you. You ain't listen. Come on, drop. There we go. Yeah, ammo. Cool with that. Oh, back off, froggy. How dare you? How dare you try and frogify me? Jerks. Oh, I love this game. It's just. It's just so good. I, I really do suggest for y'all you should pick it up. Just like if, if this looks like something you'd have fun doing because it really is just like the complete opposite of a lot of the games we play where it's like it's super complex. It requires you to really be thinking all the time about like what you're doing and everything like this. This was just all about reacting. It's all about just experiencing the game and moving with it. All right. Let's keep going. Oh, I wish I'd gotten that ammo. Oh, well. Let's do a bomb. All right. See ya. See ya. Oh, oh, oh. Give me that time. All right. Back out. Go. 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 Oh. 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 Ah! Oh, almost made it through that one without getting hit. Oh, that's too bad. Uh, I could have maybe tried to destroy those things on my way down, but it's fine. Go. Okay. Is this another boss already? Yep, that's the boss. All right, y'all. Is this big guy? All right. Um, okay, first and foremost... What? Up above? Why would you do that? Why would you do that, game? All right, all right. Okay, okay. I'm pretty sure there are other bosses that can show up randomly. I don't think it's always in the same order. I remember when I first played this game, there was like there were a couple bosses that would show up from time to time. I'd just be like, nope, just nope. Oh, nice. That was not too bad. That was not too bad. Lots of ammo. All right. Maybe we can make it all the way down, y'all. Oh, jeez. Maybe. I say maybe. Do we get rage? Do we get rage. Oh, careful. Look at all those traps. Back off, jerks. Oh, darn it. Come on. All right. Okay, okay, okay. Just keep moving. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> uh, my friends sometimes have the weirdest names. <laughs> I know exactly who that is, and uh, he gets me every time when he comes up with a new name. I love that this game takes from your Steam list and uh, puts your friends in as people you can kill. <laughs> Not that I want to kill my friends. I love my friends. Back off. I don't want anything to do with any of y'all. All right. I'll see ya. Back off, ditch digger. Hello. All right. See ya. 
Cage, cage. All right, all right, all right. Oh, loving it. Loving it, y'all. Screw it. We got rage. Die, piggies. I know that I'm normally your bestest friend and, and strongest supporter, but today is, a, is not that day. Ugh. Rage again. Yeah. Totally cool with it. Totally cool with the rage. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Here we go. All right, y'all. Oh, our time's running out. The time's running out. Grab the timer. Yeah, we're good. And that's why you always got to remember to be picking up those time pickups. If you try and rage too quickly through the whole thing, you're not going to be able to uh, survive. So always pick up the timers. What floor are we on? I'd love to find out. We haven't even died once yet, have we? It's great. Oh, shoot. It's okay. It's okay. Look out, Bum Stomper. All right. Oh, I totally hit him. Back off. Back off all of y'all. See ya. I said see ya. I said see Aw. All right. All right. Where are we at? Can we see? We're at floor 314. Yeah, we'll continue. Okay, where do we start? Yeah, right there. Cool. Perfect. Oh, I hit him. Don't act like I didn't. All right. See you. Floor 30. Oh, y'all. Y'all, the intensity is real. What? Yeah, there we go. Okay, okay. What? Jerks. See ya. Why does that not count as being able to break a spike when I fight that guy? Oh, come on. We can make it to the boss. Then maybe we're okay. Yeah, jerk. Go, go. Ah, oh, almost made it down in there. All right, floor 10. Not bad. No, piggy. Don't do it. I've got too much to live for. No. Oh, bad. It's bad. You guys, I'm freaking out. Oh, boss. I don't think I've ever even been here before. Oh, I have been here. He's an asshole. He, he'll kick my ass. Yeah, can't even hit him with a gun. Can't even hit him with a gun. You have to only hit him at like certain times, I think. This is the thing. <laughs> wow. Okay, y'all. We might not be making it to the end. I forgot that this is like the boss that I actually have in here and he just fucking annihilates me. All right, I hit him once. Okay, okay, come on. Do something. You're vulnerable. Okay. Oh, please don't hurt me. God, that... That is the worst magic ever. Was the wor Wah! That was rude. So you can only hit him once at a time. That sucks. Leave me alone. You can't even hit him with your gun. Hey, quit jumping when I jump, all right? Be fair. Wish I had another uh, uh, life, because this is close. Oh, God. Oh, God. Do it. Do it. Okay, okay. Ah! Oh, it's close, y'all. Damn it, damn it, damn it! Oof, 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 oof. Do it, come on. It's time. You kidding me? You kidding me? Okay, okay, okay. I'm gonna do it because I can. Come on, come on, do it. Oh, are you kidding? Oh, that's bullshit. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, don't be a dick, don't be a dick, don't be a dick. Don't be a dick. <laughs> That's bullshit! <laughs> ah, so close. So close. <laughs> oh, y'all. Y'all! Floor 349. Ah, ah. That was literally my best run ever. Look, every one of those scores just got annihilated. Ah, I'm so angry, but also that was freaking exhilarating. All right, y'all. Well, I hope you enjoyed this look at Super House of Dead Ninjas. I had a blast. I freaking love this game. It's tons of fun. It's just so good when you're just like, I need to like fight some stuff. I need to do some things. Uh, this game. Grab it. Pick it up. It's tons of fun. Uh, and uh, and yeah, I can't say anything more like great about it. It's just I love these kinds of just action-packed games that use the roguelite style like you can't uh memorize the room layouts because they randomize they're different every time and honestly the speed at which it moves that wouldn't even help you that much anyways all right i've been rambling enough thank you all for watching if you enjoyed the video please give it a like a favorite and don't forget to subscribe to the channel i have been price and i will see y'all next time